All right. Where am I coming from in this attack? Right through the bottom. Okay. Well, that that didn't work out. Um, all right. So, army changes. Well, let's discuss this. You need to change your army every once in a while because balancing changes happen so often in this game. That you might be using an army that has been useless for the past two quality of life updates, you know? Change change it up. And besides, you need to practice more with different troops and different combinations. You'll never become the kind of person that can, you know, make their own army and feel like they enjoy it if you don't try to be that person first. You gotta... You do have to put in quite a bit of work to... Well... It doesn't take long to make your own army, because you can think the combinations up in your mind that make sense to you. It, the problem is having the willpower to do it. Like, y you have to just do it. And a whole lot of people d don't want it. And I get it, because now you've got to change your army back for war while you're practicing with the new one. Now you've got to change the, the army you're practicing with to make it better for you. There's a bunch of different factors that you got to work with. I get it. But, you know, practice makes progress and all that. You're, you're going to get further at least trying than you would have if you didn't do anything at all. And it's not like you have to practice multiple attacks a day. You know, you can do one a day or you can do a few attacks every couple days, you know, whatever suits you best. Pretty much attack as often as you would with your normal army. Uh outside of war at least to get a feel for it change it you know, you, uh, I'm just going to start saying the same words over again I'll see you all in the next one